Well, a lot of you might have seen something that looked like this yesterday, and you might see it later on today as well. This is what we call Virga. And there's a lot going on here, but the main thing going on is you've got rain that is falling, but as it reaches the ground, it runs into a lot of dry air, and as it does so, it evaporates before it reaches the ground. Not only does that mean we don't really get a whole lot of rain and you've got some dark looking clouds, but the other thing that means is that we get a rush of wind, that cooler, denser air as it sinks down towards the surface. It evaporates, but it also will lead to that rush of wind as that denser air pushes down and gravity takes all over. And by the way, same process as you going out for a run, you sweat, you evaporate, and that leads to you cooling on down. Same thing going on here at the mid and upper levels of the atmosphere and you get that rush of wind as a result that cools you on down. Another way to kind of visualize that Virga as it happens and it's very common for us here across Colorado because we often have a lot of dry air at the surface. You get snow, but as it reaches the ground, rain or snow, it reaches that dry air and it mostly just kind of whittles on out. Sometimes you get a few raindrops in the windshield. Sometimes you can get a brief shower, but for the most part, most of that rain evaporates before it reaches the ground. So what is Virga? It's rain or snow that evaporates before it reaches the ground. You need low level dry air for it to happen. And it's really common here in Eastern Colorado because we live in a dry place.